Now, with all the cuts and closures, how far would you go if your child's school was under threat? Well, in Wiltshire, one little girl's father has stepped in and saved her school by buying it. Scott Ellis has been along to meet him. Ready? At the Mill School, they're all saying... Yeah! And it's all thanks to Olivia's generous dad. The problems began here when the school was put up for sale parents of all 62 pupils were sent letters. Uh, my parents said I was going to shut down and I'd have to move to a different school. What did you think about? I was very really upset because I have lots of friends here. Former parachute regiment captain Matt Hill came to the rescue, buying the private school for just over a million pounds. We got the letter just like all the other parents that the school was closing and um, after the initial dismay and, uh, and deciding what we were going to do next, then, you know, what we then decided to do was have a look at how we could turn the situation around. Matt's million is an investment. He runs an education company offering vocational qualifications. He'll run the courses at the school in the evenings. It's not an emotional decision. It's, a, a, you know, a, a strong business decision. Um, this has got a fantastic offering. Um, it's not utilised to its full extent, uh, you know, it can be so much more and it will be so much more and it'll be great for the whole community. The £7,000 a year mill school's been here for more than 50 years. The hope is now that its future's secure for at least another 50. Scott Ellis, BBC Points West, Pottern.